Welcome back, strategists. The battle at Tongate results in a victory for Kalkan's so, army. So, last episode, retreats to the I was a bit like, oh no, um, I don't know what comes next, but um, I don't know what comes next then. Yuvei amasses new forces with which to oppose Cao Cao and forms an alliance with Liu Zhang of the Yi province. I like how in this reality, they form a, like, an alliance. Like, before Liu Zhang's like, I can never betray Cao Cao, no! And now he's just like, oh, now I'll betray Cao Cao. Zhang Fei invade Hang Zhang and convinces Kai Wengi, Queen of Fu, to assault Smart girl Kai Wengi, Queen of Fu. Um, Kao so... As you guys all know, by splitting his army into three parts, I've got a bit of a soft spot for Kai Wengi, um, mainly because she's the Queen of Fu. Um, so chances are I'm probably going to go with her one um, for the main story um, and carry that on. Um, but so in that case, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do these battles, um, just so we can see every level. Um, so I'm going to do these ones, um, and then we'll carry on after we do all three, so you get the chance to see them all. Uh, I think we're going to start off with Mount Dinjun, because I don't think I've actually... I'm not sure if I've ever done Mount Dinjun from Kaka's side before. Show our true strength. If I have, I don't remember it at all. Let the meeting begin. Everyone lay out your ideas. Let's see what they've got to say. Our territory is Let me guess, refugees. But it is almost impossible to secure provisions for the entire army. Shouldn't we purchase supplies from an area that has had plentiful harvest for some years? Oh, okay, actually using money rather than just running out refugees, okay. Zheng Fei is the enemy's general. We must train for this battle. I mean, he's not really your father's enemy in this reality, mate. There can so. be no mistakes. The only thing enemy general Zhang Fei has going for him is his bravery. Even so, we can't afford to be careless. I think we should recruit some new soldiers. Sire, what do you wish us to do? I mean, I'm not going to carry on with this one, but obviously I want to do what's best for me. Um, I guess troop strength still is my weakest thing, right? I've made up my mind. We will be victorious. My yes. lord. My lord. Who knows, maybe if like I get some cool characters out of this one that can rival Kai Wengi, maybe I'll go with this one. I'll make like separate saves. Any new soldiers. Zheng Fei, leading the Shu army, invades Han Zhang. Opposing him is Jia Hao Ba, who burns with vengeance for the death of his father, Jia Hao Yuan, killed at the hand of Zheng Fei. Off screen, may I add, Jia it's happened off screen in this playthrough. Now, as a result of his impetuous attack, Han Zhang's most strategic point, Mount Dinjun, lies in the hands of the enemy. Cao Cao, leading a unit of reinforcements, hurries to Han Zhang. Along with Jia Hao Ba's army, they attempt to crush Zhang Fei at Mount Dinjun. dare you disobey? You leave swearing to avenge your father? You return with your tail between your legs! I have no excuse! My lord, I know I deserve to die! Then you are ready for death! My lord, please forgive him! Please! Get out of my way, Antler Man! It looks weird there. Jiahaoba, sometimes a general, must choose to act like a coward in the field. You can't defeat hands by making a mad dash into oblivion. A quick temper cannot be cured overnight. From now on, you'll be working with Sima Yi. Very wise words. I'm impressed by your wisdom. To war council, immediately! My lord! <laughs> Jab is gonna like crawl there, it's like Arr. I mean that was really nice. I feel like this one really shows Kaka's character development. Report on your situation. According to the report by the scouting unit, we have been unable to locate the position of the enemy, but we have found their storehouse. 
That's suspicious. For victory to be ours in this battle, it is imperative that we force General Sang Fei's unit to retreat. If my lord's unit is forced to flee, then we will be defeated. That's sad. State your strategies. Listen to my humble strategy. The outcome of this battle hinges on the storehouses. We must successfully defend ours while attacking theirs. Therefore, I suggest that my lord protect our storehouse. I think we should attack the storehouse like this, in two groups. Once their storehouse is gone, Liu Bei's demoralized army will be an easy target. That makes sense. Okay. Who's next? I also have a strategy, my lord. Well, you're a strategist, so I would hope so. I've been surveying the terrain in this area for some time. And I found a secret mountain road that only the locals know about. Lord Jiahu Ba's units and mine should curve around this mountain route and attack the enemy from the rear. It will take some time to arrive at the battlefield, but the unexpected attack will confuse the enemy and result in a total rout. So we just have to bide our time and then he would take down the storehouse. Lord, give ear to my strategy. Okay. I ask my lord to protect the storehouse. Then we will plant decoys here, with mines concealed underneath. The decoys will look like soldiers and lure the enemy onto the mines. Many will be blown away. The rest of the units will join in on the attack on the enemy storehouse. I'm always a fan of mines, but... Lord, which strategy will you have us employ? This one's slightly dangerous in that we lose a bunch of people. That this one doesn't make any sense because if everyone just comes up the side of the mines, yeah, one of them gets hit in the mines, but then Kaka's completely surrounded. This one kind of makes sense, but that just basically involves us brute forcing our way through. I'm gonna try this one. This one sounds interesting. Let's use this strategy. Battle. Yes, yes sir. sir. Let's have a look at our units now. Hold up. So who have we got? I've got... Well, I don't actually have Uncle here. Huh. So we've got Shang Liao, and we've got Ojia, and... So I guess we just wait then. I imagine eventually like, someone's gonna attack us. Surely. Hello? Hello? Oh. No. Oh! Yes, I do see movement. Hmm, they got here sooner than I thought they would. Oh, there's a lot of them.
Is there four of them? The strategy might be a bad idea. Hopefully, some of the ones in the back crash into each other, um, and we'll be fine. Never heard that voice clip before. Show them what a true charge looks like. Huang Zhong is a bit of a problem there. Okay, no, it looks like he might be a little bit stuck. Mm, you know, I'll come back. I'll let them be confused for a bit. I'll come back for a charge. Looks like Wong Jong might be getting rammed. At least if it's anyone that gets tired like that, Shang Liao, Shang Liao's turn. Oh, someone else has appeared now. Right, let's see if we can do some decent damage to Zhugaliong here.
Mr. Zhang Wei. Otashi! Someone else has appeared now. Who could that be? It's Masu! Right, well, this isn't ideal. Need to do as much damage here as possible then. I'll leave the, the ice one for Masu. For the Empire, make way for Zhang Liao. That's all. <laughs> you are nothing. I think Gujira would have went to fight with Hong Zhong. Oh, ah, no, for whatever reason, it's not sending my others to. Kakao Kaka will be fine for a while. I think. It's pretty strong and he's got a rally. Well, we found Zhang Fei. The biggest problem there is being surrounded is really reducing our number. That's not too bad then. You're a horseshoe, aren't you? Yeah, you no. You come to the rescue. You I'm going now. Like, she hoped I would get this mighty pool 
quicker, but I'd rather have Geo back head up because he can help us out by bumping the up quicker. Okay, so Zhang He is doing quite well. I could probably use another volley and finish them off, but I feel like there's no need. I feel like it's a bit overkill. As good as Zhang Liao is, being completely surrounded by two people is probably not the best. I need you to send reinforcements. Lord Zheng Liao! I'm coming now! Thank you so much. I owe you a huge favor. You'll be fine, Zheng Liao. Mm, I hope you'd be more fine than that, but okay. Down. All right, why don't you just go down? Okay, well, that loss is also really damaged Zhang Wei, which is a plus.
I <laughs> just ran and say, like, oh, nope, iron wall, that's right. Don't charge him. Fools. The main unit is vulnerable. Lord! I will help you soon! He's fine. That was not the one I wanted to charge in, but fine. Give me your strength. It was a close battle, but the mandate's with us. Master Juge Leon, I'm so sorry. Mate, hold on. Yes, man, you're, you're going for them. Ooh, Kakao's not doing great. Wait, we're just having you blast mess with a bunch of magic. Wait, we'll take him down before seeing you get him.
Oh, they didn't really do anything. They really confused him, I guess. Shang here has learned Raid, which is nice, but he's also an archer unit, so it's like not the best. I mean, is that really going to help? Probably not, but they're all confused now, so. And you how bad going to beat Zhang Pei on his own, so. How dare you? Soldiers never die. Their legends live on. Jang <laughs> Hay is just getting all the experience in this level. So I guess if you're a really big fan of Zhang Ye and you want power level him, this is the, this is the way to do it. Yeah, so Pur Zhang Fei is just completely surrounded now. I don't think there's any way for Zhang Li to enter. No, probably not. Your head to the spirit of my father. <laughs> Sounds like you miss your father. Why don't I send you to join him? I wonder how many different, like, um, dual dialogues there are, like, unique ones.
There you go, Shia. How about character development? Uh, what went wrong? Where was all my energy? That's it now. I swear, I'll take your head, Jang Fei. I kind of feel like that jewel should have done like a bit more damage, but you can't regret your actions once you're dead. There we go. The enemy general has been defeated! We've won! You who defy the mandate of heaven, learn your lesson. I'm here to report that our army is strong and our country prospers from the spoils of war. Yay! So even the ones that weren't there got promoted as well, that's just pretty good. Um, so we'll leave this one off here, and because I'll probably make separate saves for each of these ones and then Depending on how I feel each of them have went, depends on which one I will go with. Um, I mean, like I said, I am more, like, drawn towards Kai Wenge, Queen of Fu, just because, you know, it's Kai Wenge, Queen of Fu. How could you not be? But, we'll see. I didn't really get anyone from this one. Zhang He got a lot of experience. That's a plus, right? Um, I guess Zhang Liao also got some, because he took down two people, technically. So, I mean, that's pretty good to tell. Um, but we'll see how it goes. Um, next up, we'll probably do the Battle of Fanzhong, the one that is against Guan Yu. Till then, always remember, those who fail to plan, plan to fail. See ya.